Yo, what's up guys? It's Gabs here and welcome to another video. Today, we're going to be doing my 2020 predictions for the WXL freshman list. Um, now, I did this last year and last year I think I, pretty, I, I did pretty well. Um, other than the fact that they did three women. It was it was a very weird year. Um, but this year, I think it, I actually found it a lot easier to fill out the list. Um, Last year, I, I, I guess I just wasn't, I don't know if I was just not in tune with the culture enough, or I just didn't know, but there was like three throwaways that I just put in on the end, but this, this one, I think there's an argument for all of them to be on this list. Um, so, let's start off with who's not going to make it. Unfortunately, Pop Smoke's not going to make it. Like, if he was alive right now, he would be on the list. Pop Smoke would be on the list. But, unfortunately, um, he was murdered in January, I believe. No, February. So, he will not be making the list. Which is very sad, honestly. Um, also, there's not going to be another another three-woman year, I don't think. I don't think. I think they're going to go back to one woman maybe two um but i don't know enough women rappers to you know make up a list of people who could make it i have one on my list but you know whatever um so let's just start off um i guess we could start off with the woman um doja cat i mean there's no real arguing about it. Um, I forget even what's what she what she what song she has, but I I know I've heard the name uh, probably on TikTok a lot. Does she do say so? I think she does say so. But um, yeah, she will be on the list. I mean, there's no when else that you can say would be on the list, in my opinion. Um, second off, the Kid Leroy. Um, man's blown up over the last six months. Well, not really blown up, but he's got one major track, major track, uh, with another person who's on this list. But uh, he does have two tracks that are amazing. Um, I would not be surprised if he starts releasing a lot more, especially if he's trying to make the list. That list is in April, so I would not be surprised if we see another The Kid Leroy track by the end of the month. Um, yeah, he did do that uh, one, like, leak, or sorry, snippet on TikTok, where <laughs> he calls uh, Addison Ray a, a bad bitch. So... Who knows? Um, it does sound fire, though. Um, he is very talented from Australia. Bro, this kid... If not this year, next year he's making it. Like, if not this year. But I would not be surprised if he's on this year. Um, also on the list, uh, his collaborator, Lil Tecca. I mean, the man has blown up since June last year. If if he was like two months earlier, he would have been on last year's list. But this year, he's definitely on the list. Um, Ransom did it again. Um, <laughs> like you, you can't keep this guy off the off of your playlist. He's just such a good artist. Um, he has a collaboration with uh, a boogie. You know, um, like. New York rap had a good year last year. I will say that. Um, so, also, uh, next, Lil TJ, who I'm pretty sure is also from New York. Not sure. Has collaborations with Lil Tecca. Um, but, bro, pop out at your party, you know. Uh, go in, FN. I can't even list all the songs. This dude is honestly one of the best artists out there right now, um, in my opinion. Um, he's very, very, um, 
I don't know what the word, like, creative, I guess, but, like, talented, and he doesn't need auto-tune. We've seen that with his Einer Banks videos. Um, so this dude is definitely going to make the list. Um, in, in fact, I'd say he's a lock for the list. Um, his collaborator, Polo G, for sure, for Pop Out at your party. I don't listen to much Polo G, I just know that one song. Um, but I'm pretty sure he's pretty popping otherwise too. So, for sure, he is going to make the list. Um, Jack Harlow. Now, Jack Harlow, I think, <laughs> I mean, he could have made last year's list, in my opinion. But this year, he's uh, for sure a lock. Um, he, he's been around for a while. I mean, Dark Knight was out in 2017, I believe. Um, and that, that song still banks like honestly he's now got what's poppin he's now got um i think collaborations with like oh fuck i don't remember who he's collaborated with but it was the album that came out last summer um and he's he's got like a bunch of tracks he's honestly probably the, one of my favorite rappers now um, he just doesn't have the disco discography that a lot of other rappers do, um, in my opinion. Uh, so in like two years, you'll see Jack Harlow everywhere, honestly. Um, and only Choppa. <laughs> I think this is the, if you're talking about guarantees, you're talking about Lil TJ and Emily Choppa, Shot of Flow, Capo, Camelot. Um, I haven't really seen a mu many features by Anomaly Choppa, um, that might just be me not being in tune with the culture, but he is 15 or 16, running the town, um, honestly, an amazing artist, yeah, <laughs> like, you can't, you can't, he, he's mainstream too, so you can't say no to him. Um, this is where my list gets a little bit on the riskier side, uh, as prediction-wise, you know, uh, I'm gonna say this two, uh, these two as a duo, um, BB No Money and Young Gravy. Um, they have their own little subsection of rap. They aren't following the net like ev what everyone else is doing. They're almost they they literally are like overhyped stereotype like overdone stereotypes but making actual music with it um like some of their bars are like <laughs> almost ironic um but it works and it's actually catchy um so yeah i think they could make it they are i mean bb no money had um La la la. That that in itself is enough to make him the list. And I think Young Gravy's been rumored for the next the past three years. Why not just put him because they are collaborative. They have a collaborative album coming out too, or I think it might have already come out. I'm not sure, but they are definitely worthy of making it. And then finally, I have Josiah. Who, if you don't know who he is, he sings Shenanigans, the one that... Da, 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 da. Yeah, that's the instrumental. Um, he also does... Uh, um, he also has a song with 6 9 I forget the, what it's called. I think it might be like Case 13 or something. I'm not sure. But he is probably one of those ones where you could swap it out with any artist with like one good track. That, that that's it's this kind of year where it's like one good track like last year it was YK or Cyrus with the one good track of worth it so um, he's going to be that spot um, unless someone comes up in the next two weeks which I highly doubt yeah it's going to be Josiah um, but yeah that's gonna be it for today's video be sure to like subscribe all that good shit and I'll see you guys Wednesday. I gonna stand on the drum of the guys that you talk and they move in a zombie. Just in the body. I get on love her, but I said I love her cause I was so one of the Molly. Yo, something to
sorry Wanna deep to the party Only Uber big body Till I cop that Rari Pussy start no car key I am so sick of these bitches They trippin' I swear that they left for Kalani 